Before this video starts, I would like to say that the product that we will be unboxing today is from Home Tester Club. Home Tester Club is an open source, open mouth uh, company that provides you a product just for your honest review. Any information for Home Tester Club will be provided on the screen now and also I will put the link to Home Tester Club to join them to start receiving your free products and reviewing them down below in the description below. Alright, from here, roll that intro. Like I previously said, this product is from Home Tester Club. Uh, don't know what the product is. I kind of actually have a clue, but at the same time, I'm uncertain as I haven't opened the pro I've opened the box yet. I am supposed to be receiving something from Home Tester Club, but we will just have to see what we get into when we open the box all right so i got my trusty handy dandy knife here let's open it up white ball knife so i should be getting i need to get a new one but You ain't really got a lot of money to do and spend do with what you got at the moment and you don't worry about this thing else. Yeah. Alright, it's open. Off goes the knife. When you open Box. First thing you see is this. The ion mug with a little piece of paper down there. Well, since this is from Home Tester Club, we gotta look at what the paper wants me to do first. So we're gonna pull that out and then we're gonna read it. Alright, so basically what it says is, whoa, that light, it's this time. And then on the back, it, uh, it just has information about what I got, which is the ion, uh, ion mug. That light is way too bright. Ion mug. So, oh, now that we know what we got to do, we got to review this, put it to the test. So, what I am going to do is I am going to unbox it, but after I unbox it, I'm going to make a cup of coffee and put the product to test and then show you guys my results and view it see uh so you know if it's even worth buying because if it's not worth buying it then all right so let's open this shall we continue all right as i said we're gonna open this up give it a little look then Test it, and then give my final review on the product. There we go. Keep on the bottom. Then we're gonna give my final review on the product. I just noticed that you guys cannot see anything that I'm doing. I am very much struggling 
with getting the tape off. Yeah, I can't do it like that. I need to invest in a camera so I don't have to use my laptop all the time. Come on, get in there. Quite fat of a knife. Alright, this time we're not gonna throw it. We're just gonna drop it right there. Alright, might have got a little mad. Kind of tore the box up, kind of get it off, but uh, we potentially uh, got it off. Now we need the thing on that knife again. Good thing I just dropped it down here. I got the knife. Let's finally get this product opened up, and I just spit everywhere. I am very sorry. All right. Come on. Got it. I think. Yeah, I actually get it. I don't know. No, it does not appear that I did. It appears that I missed it completely. Come on. Yeah, we got it that time. Oh. And bam, one side has officially been open, so now we can take it out of the old box. God, oh, it really stinks. Oh. Alright, so as soon as, well, what happened? Okay. Oh, don't do that, computer. There you go. As soon as you get it out of the box, you are greeted with pentlet. You are greeted with a little pen. Oh, cut there. You are greeted with a little pamphlet when you get it out the box. Uh, this is like a uh, instructional thing, I guess. What's in the box? The cool thing about this product is that the base, this thing here, can also charge cell phones and stuff. I thought that was pretty cool that it can do that. It's got a, uh, I don't know if you can see that. Looks as so as it's got a USB Type C to charge it. You also have your little. Charging wire, which, yep, USB Type C. Can you see it? Yeah, USB Type C. It's kind of weird seeing how it's. It's not it, like you can't pick it. Like it's not a U. Like I don't know. What I'm talking about. Oh, is there anything else? Oh, yes. The lid, it's, um, what is that thing called? Ceramic? Ceramic, it's a ceramic lid. The cup is also very much ceramic. Uh, Temperature, constant temperature mug for the best taste with the ceramic lid. It's like that. That's what it looks like. So now you know what we have to do, right? We got to put it to the test. First thing first, 
I'm going to clean it because it smells really, really bad. So, once I clean it, once I get some coffee in it, get it the way I like it, we will put it to the test and see just how good this thing is. All right, guys. I will be back shortly. Right. I got everything done. The coffee. I don't want to spill it. It's right here. Coffee right here. It smells amazing. Uh, how about you guys? Uh, let me know what kind of coffee do you guys like? I like Maxwell. And I like it dark with a lot of sugar in it. If you guys can let me know what kind of coffee you guys like, that'd be very much appreciated. Let's take a sip and then we're all uh, gonna try to see how it is. Amazing. All right, that's the coffee and it is amazing. Black with just a heaping amount of sugar. That's the way I like it. All right, we do also, sorry about the camera. I'm, I am only using my laptop and it's uh, a bit hectic. Now this thing, like I said earlier, there's the light. Uh, this thing can charge uh, a cell phone also. It's got to be a certain kind of cell phone. I'm not familiar with the kind of cell phone it is. Most likely like Samsung, the very expensive ones. But it can also keep your mug warm. So that's what we're going to try right now. I'm going to do something very stupid, which I don't advise you to do. I'm going to hold it over my laptop and put it down i don't know how i'm gonna do this because i only have one camera this is gonna be very stu actually i will sit my computer on the floor Ugh. there we go computers on the floor let's see if i can get a good angle yeah there's a coffee Oh, I'm tangled up in wires. Alright. So, we got coffee. We should switch these two so you can see it. Coffee and the heating thing. We're going to go ahead and put the mug on here. Let's see what it does. Okay, there is a light that is blinking and it just turned solid and now it's just dimming in and out. I don't know if you guys can see it here. Let me make it to where you can see it. Ooh, but it did get hot. It did get a little hot. Alright. Why is my cords all jacked up? Give me a second. I gotta figure out my cord court problem, but I will be right back once I get that done. Uh, from court problems have been solved. So, as I said, there's a light that comes on when you put this mug on. I'm going to half put it on to see if you guys can see it. No, you can't. You really can't. All right. Well, let's see if I can hold it in my hands and then put it on. Can you see it now? Oh. No, you can't. Well, unfortunately, you guys can't see the light that comes on. Oh, no, you can. Okay, so there is light that comes on and it's very dim on the computer for some reason. It's very hard to see. 
Um, so we're going to give it a little bit and see how long it takes to start heating the element up and uh, heat the keep the coffee heated up. Coffee is already very hot, but we're going to keep it going. And I will be right back in about 10 minutes to see to see if there's been any progress. All right, guys, it's been about 15 minutes now. I've been drinking the coffee off and on, and it's actually, because coffee usually gets cold after, like, 10 minutes if there's, like, no heating element that you're keeping it on, or if it's not something like this. But this has actually been keeping it consistently at, 113 degrees Fahrenheit, or I think it's like, I don't know, I don't know what it is, Celsius, but it, it says what it's advertising as on the box and everything, it's doing what it says, I just don't know how it's doing it, because if you put your hand on the, uh, the, uh, charger, it's not hot to the touch. I don't know how it's because the cup the cup is very hot. It's very hot. I mean I don't know if you can tell but when I open it up it's steamy. But it's doing as it says. And I mean so far I actually do like it. So I will be writing a review on the Home Tester Club website. I know it's kind of weird seeing me lay down like this, but I will be writing a review on the Home Tester Club website about this product. Um, any information that you need to know about this product right here, the Ion Mug with Charging Coaster will be popping up on your screen right now. Unfortunately, at this moment, there is no website available for the Ion Mug with charging because I did not find any information on it. The only information I have is a information on Home Tester Club, and that information, as it seems, is not public yet. So, the only thing I can suggest you do is in like about a month. Come back to the video, and I will have more information on it. Alright guys, thanks for watching, and I'll catch you guys on the flip side. Bye! If you guys enjoyed this video, please make sure to hit the like button, and smash the subscribe button, Right now, there will be a playlist on your right and the previous video on your left. Uh, as of right now, we will be pumping out videos every Wednesday and Friday. So keep tuned and I will catch you on the flip side.